I'm Elizabeth James and I was intending to do um, a video blog diary of the weeks after my surgery um, but I sort of got a bit lazy and started doing a two week one, two week after one but it didn't sort of really turn out very well um, so I'm doing a nearly eight weeks post. Um, yeah so it's on Thursday, or Friday technically, it will be eight weeks since my operation. It's the 9th of February today. Um, so yeah, I'm just doing uh, another update of everything. Um, everything's gone really well. I'm really pleased with everything. It's completely changed um, a lot, you know, physically, and um, my confidence, I feel, is better, and other people have com commented on that. I generally just feel more comfortable in myself and everything like that so that's one thing that I'm very glad I've had it done. Um, it's changed the way I talk. Um, I do musical theatre so we do a lot of voice work and analysis, self-analysis so it's been quite interesting looking at work that I did before Christmas and work I'm doing now. Um, I can actually say my S's but I'm still having to do work on my S's because I'm placing everything wrong apparently. Um, but yeah, so generally everything's a whole lot clearer with my speech, um, T's and D's and everything, it's just, it's quite weird actually being able to say them, which sounds really stupid, but anybody out there who has, who had the same problem as me will understand what I mean. Um, the food front of everything has been a whole, a whole lot better than I thought. Um, the first week, I think I've said previously, was horrible. <laughs> Um, it was literally milkshake, that's all I could really drink, um, it was just generally really horrible, but since then I've been able to eat pretty much anything, um, as long as it's all cut, cut up and I can just swallow it, because obviously I'm still not allowed to chew yet, um, but I do have an appointment on Thursday, so in two days I have an appointment with the surgeons, and I'm really hoping that they tell me that I can eat, um, like chew, because that would be just awesome and if they do then my mum said that we can go for something to eat and then when I come home we're all going to have a big um, Domino's night here at uni so that should be good. Um, I haven't been allowed to drink alcohol either because of stitches just in case they dissolve them too quickly. I think I, I kind of guess that I should be able to drink now but I don't want to risk it just in case so I'm going to wait till the surgeons tell me I can. Look-wise, it's really changed the way I look. When I came back to university, so many people were just sort of looking at me like, is that you? Um, and I think even now I'm still getting used to it and people I haven't seen for a while are really like, oh, hello. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm not completely used to it yet. It's changed a lot. My nose goes up. And I can't get used to that. That's the that's the one thing that's really just weird. Um, yeah, so that's good. But generally, everything is looking really good. I, as you can see, my bite is absolutely perfect. Um, I'm generally I'm so happy with it. I feel so much better in myself. Um, like I said, my confidence is gone up um, people thought I was confident anyway but honestly just generally going out clubbing or whatever I feel so I don't feel as self-conscious um, the only thing I do feel self-conscious about at the moment is I can't I still can't feel my lip my bottom lip and quite a lot of my chin um, but it's not really a big deal it's only annoying because of the course I'm doing it involves a lot of physical work with the mouth um, <laughs> So it's hard to say like B's and P's. I can say them, but because I can't feel doing it, I don't know whether I'm doing it right. And people say I am. I'm like, yeah, I know, but I can't feel it. So it's it's really hard to explain. Um, but it's it's cool and everything's going really well. And I'm so pleased I've had it done. I can't stress that enough to you. Um, the pain I haven't had any pain, uh, it gets a few, it gets a bit achy at times, um, I can't sort of do a lot of jumping, <laughs> um, but again that's getting better now, 
um, the swelling has pretty much all gone. It's a little bit here at the cheeks. Um, nobody else can tell but me know my face. I know that it's still swollen here. And it's quite swollen inside my mouth. Um, it still feels really quite tight and just generally really swollen and small inside my mouth. So, um, But yeah, there's no scars, no bruising, nothing. It's all just re gone so well. And... You know, I've seen the orthodontist and they said that everything's looking great. I thought I'd show you a before and after shot as well. Um, here's what I did look like. And this was the day after the operation, which I look awful. And as you can see, I was really red and swollen, but not really any bruising. Um, and this is me at the moment, so you can see, and here's a profile shot. <laughs> um, so it's just waiting to hear what the surgeons say, and if they tell me that I can chew, I'll post another video to you lot, um, and I'll be so happy. <laughs> um, so yeah, if there's any questions um, that you want to ask if you're having this surgery or if you're just curious, um, then I'll be happy to answer it. I've been really lucky and had such an, not an easy ride, but I've been lucky enough for it all to go really well. I've recovered really quickly. I think my biggest advice to people out there that's going to have it done or is having it done is just to sort of try and get back into your normal routine really quick. I felt that once I was doing stuff and visiting friends over Christmas or you know getting back into uni that everything really started taking place um, and it makes you feel better as well if you're just sitting around your house feeling sorry for yourself then you know it's all psychological you're not going to get better. <laughs> um, so yeah let me know if you're having it done or again if you've got any questions I'd be happy to ask um, yeah and I will see you in a few days once I know I can chew or not <laughs>